prove by mathematical induction that 7 to the power of 8 n plus 3 plus 2 is divisible by 5. The first step is as usual. We consider the first possible value of n. Here it's 0 because n is natural number. So for n equals 0, our expression becomes 7 to the power of 8 times 0 plus 3 plus 2, which is equal to 345, and it is divisible by 5. Hence, true for n equals 0 is divisible if uh, number uh, ends in uh, 5 or 0. So the next step we write assume assume true for n equals k and just rewrite 7 to the power of 8k plus 3 plus 2 uh, but how to indicate that uh, it's divisible by 5? It means that it can be represented as 5 multiplied by some integer. The next step, consider n equals k plus 1. So it becomes 7 to the power of 8 times k plus 1 plus 3 and plus 2 is equal to 7 to the power of 8k plus, I write uh, 3 firstly and then 8, and plus 2, which is equal to 7 to the power of 8k plus 3, multiplied by 7 to the power of 8 plus 2, and is equal to, and as usual, uh, we should uh, use a statement from assume true for n equals k and uh, here we can replace this by 5m minus 2. So it is equal to 5m minus 2 and multiplied by 7 to the power of 8 and plus 2. And our aim is to show that it is, divisible, it is divisible by 5, so it should be represented as 5 multiplied by some parentheses, so that it looks like 5 multiplied by some, uh, not k, for example, l, where l is uh, integer. So, Let's open parentheses and it becomes 5m 7 to the power of 8 minus 2 times 7 to the power of 8 plus 2. And it is equal to 5m 7 to the power of 8. And we can factor out 2 and it becomes 7 to the power of 8 minus 1. Or actually if uh, we can show that each term is divisible by 5, uh, then um, uh, so we also uh, show that uh, all expression is divisible by 5. And uh, definitely we need to calculate uh, this and uh, it must end uh, in uh, 0 or 5. So we need calculate uh, it's uh, 7 squared, 7 to the power of 4 and, and minus 1. So it is equal to
So it is equal to 5m times 7 to the power of 8 minus 2 multiplied by this value. And actually we can factor out 5 and show that it's uh, 5 uh, uh, L, where L is integer, or we can just write that uh, all terms, all terms, terms are divisible by 5, hence all expression is divisible by 5, and uh, therefore true for n equals k plus 1. And conclusion, if true for n equals k, true for n equals k plus 1. Since true for n equals 0, true for, for any n is natural. And that's all for this question.